If you ever see a building looking crooked like this, <laughs> the reason is quite simple. Poor setting out. My name is Ofosu Kwache. For those who don't know what setting out is, it is basically transferring the footprint of the building design onto the actual site through markings. There are two common approach when setting out, either by one, using the total station or two, doing it manually. Let's talk about the manual setting out. For the start, you would need wooden pegs, set square, cyberboard, thread, nails, a marker, and POP powder. Firstly, the wooden pegs will be used to establish the actual position of the building based on the architectural plan. Secondly, you will ensure that the pegs are properly aligned with the aid of a thread and a set square. Once you confirm that, a space of at least one meter should be left all around the building. This is purposely done to set up your board and give enough room for the building excavation. Now this is where things get interesting because if the grid line on your foundation plan was not done properly. Hey, I am me. Wahala. Because the labeled grid line acts as the basis for the excavation. Once all the lines have been marked on the board and on the site, you can go ahead to excavate. Kindly take note that every contractor might have their own approach when it comes to setting out. However, these are the basic steps that run through all procedures. It is always advisable to get an experienced contractor to collaborate with the architect on the day of setting out in order to achieve proper alignment. Do well to subscribe to my YouTube channel. My name is Ofosukwache. See you on the other side.